Hi, I'm teacher Aparna. I will give you some extra knowledge related to the topics. You may have heard many times the saying, an idle mind is devil's workshop. When people say that the devil finds work in idle hands, they mean that if people don't have anything to do with their time, they are more likely to get involved in trouble and criminality. If you don't have any particular goal in mind, you can be easily distracted and trouble is bound to follow. Do you agree or disagree with this proverb? Discuss with your friends why you feel this way. Mention examples from your own life. New words LOL To lie around lazily Minu is just lolling around the park all day. Log, trunk of a tree that has been cut. The turtle is resting on the log of wood. Shirk, to avoid something that should be done. Raju always tries to shirk his duties. We should not shirk duties for fear of failure. In vain, uselessly. The doctor's effort to save the patient was in vain. Prefer, like something better. Lena prefers pencil drawing to painting. The Lazy Frog On a school day, you are busy studying, playing and chatting with friends. When you have a holiday from school, what do you do? Would you behave a little like the frog in the following poem? The Lazy Frog Fred is a very lazy frog who lolls all day upon a log. He always manages to shirk doing a single stroke of work. His poor old mother calls in vain, Come in and help. He does not bother to move two inches, much preferring to be extremely hard of hearing. He lies there in a silent heap and stays conveniently asleep. If a lady frog hops past, you'd think he would get up at last to bow and help her on her way. But no, I'm ashamed to say that when a lady frog comes by, he does not open up one eye. Summary Fred is a very lazy frog. He does not like to do a bit of work. When his mother asks him to come and help her, he pretends to be deaf. He likes to sleep all day. Even when a lady frog comes that way, he just keeps lying with his eyes shut.